Welcome back to part three, part three of less conversation, more action, please. Part three. Now, yesterday I talked about doing it for yourself. Now, when you're doing it for yourself, think of the big picture. Think of your big picture, not your, not your parents' big picture, not your siblings' big picture, not your boss's big picture, your own big picture. Where do you fit in to your own big picture? And then where does everybody else fit in your big picture? See, because when you're doing things for yourself, you put yourself at the center and there's absolutely nothing wrong with that. But consider the fact that other people's lives are going on and they themselves are at the center of their big picture. And if they can't realize that others have their own big picture that they're a center of, then their stuff is wrong. Their shit is broken. It's true. If they can't realize that other people have their own lives and their own expectations and their own wants, their own needs and their own doing and their own making and their own happenings, then they've got problems. You and I, I realize that fact. I have my wife. She has her own world that she has to deal with. I'm part of that world, just like she's part of my world. We have kids. They're part of our world, just like we are part of their world. But my daughter now is getting ready to go on her own, to face the world on her own. And I hope I've contributed as much as I can to that, to that life of hers. But now she has to put herself in the center and now she's got to do what's right for her. Just like I have to do what's right for me, just like my brother has to do what's right for him, just like my old army buddy has to do what's right for him. We all have to do what's right for ourselves. And that is the big picture we need to look at. That's the big picture we need to believe in. That's the big picture we need to focus on and not worry about somebody else's crap, somebody else's nonsense, somebody else's inabilities to maintain relationships, somebody else's inabilities to build relationships, somebody's inability to actually sit down and quit talking and start doing. I gotta worry about myself. I have a legacy to look forward to. I've got a legacy to build, just like all of us have a legacy to build, whether we wanna believe it or not. But the thing is, is that we need to focus on the big picture and that big picture is our own self big picture. Nobody else's. I can't worry about somebody else's big picture. You can't worry about somebody else's big picture. You worry about your own. If their stuff is broken, let them be broken. They don't want to fix themselves. You can't fix them. It's just that simple. Somebody stays in a relationship because, oh, I'm only thinking about the children. You can't fix that. That's their broken. Somebody stays in a relationship because they don't want to be alone. Well, they find themselves alone and they're lonely, but they want to stay in that relationship. Well, that's their problem. They're broken. It's not your problem. 